Yo, what's going on, Sexy Sam Lunda Squad? I'm starting this recording a little bit early because a lot of people are accusing me of when I make videos like that Man Decor's video yesterday, or Mark Decor's, sorry, where I say he's the new best god in Duel. Uh, they think that I'm just trying to clickbait them, get the get the view, get you know the ad revenue, whatever. Um, and I don't actually play him or believe it, but I just want to show you one case in point. I am, I think. I played 12 games with him, but I don't think two of them counted for some reason. I technically am 12 and 0, but I think the leaderboard says I'm 10 and 0. Um, everyone I fought was GM. So, well, most people I fought were GM. Some of them were even MMR capped GMs, and I just slaughtered them. And I fought a couple of Manticorus or Marticorus mirror matches as well. So just to prove that I do practice what I preach sometimes. When, it, when I make accusations like very, very, very good gods in duel, I keep it up. Now, here's the second thing. This is broken. There's an item called um, <clears throat> Vital... I want to say it's Vital Ambusher, but I don't think it is. El Vital Amplifier, right? Vital Amplifier, yeah. So Vital Amplifier is single-handedly the strongest item in the game. <laughs> it's uh, it's dumb in <clears throat> more than one way. <clears throat> let me, you know, let me just read it to you. So, vital amplifier gives you forty physical power. Ah, eh, that's that's a good physical power. Two hundred health. Okay, that's pretty good. Good survivability. Good sustain with the fifteen MP five. Good attack speed with the twenty percent attack speed. Oh, but what what? What is this? PSV. Player self buff, I think. Um, after healing yourself or an allied god with an ability, you gain 10% attack speed and 5% basic attack damage for 6 seconds, stacking a total of 3 times. That means the passive of this item gives you 30% attack speed and 15% basic attack damage. You know what that means? You know what that means? That means you're getting 40 power... 50% attack speed. 50% attack speed. Yeah, let that sink in. With 15% damage. On your basics. Like, you add the 40 power. You add the 50% attack speed. And then on top of everything... Eh, let's do an extra 15% damage on the top. Okay. Yes, yeah, so you tank the red buff. What are you doing? This is not a life you want to live. Kami, I don't think I don't think that was the play. My main man, Kami. He did want the he, he wanted the red buff. Honestly, you got to give credit where credit's due. Either way, though, this this duel is not about my enemy. Or how competitive this game is going to be. Because once I once I buy Vital Amplifier, this game is going to be a joke. I want you all to understand exactly what I mean. This game will be easy. I will not have to try. I will hold down my left mouse button. And everything in the vicinity will die. I'm not kidding. By the way, I go Transcendence again instead of Dominance. Because Dominance... I, the, it gives you 15% attack speed, but you don't really need the 15% attack speed if you're having 50% attack speed from Vital. You can kind of forego that extra attack speed. My blue buff, you absolute baboon. How dare you? How dare you? My ult did 419 damage to him. It's a lot of damage. Especially because he only has like 800 health right now, right? How much health do you have? Um, yeah, 950. I did half your health with my, with my ult and my two. So Vital Amplifier, by the way, is a 2450 item. Yeah, 2450. So it's not expensive. Oh, hello. You scared the vagina out of me. Did I say you scared the vagina out of me? I don't have a vagina. Um. All right. 
How much is tier two? 1300? 1300 for 20 power, 100 health. <coughs> I wouldn't say vital amplifier is a good item until it's full evolution. Like it's tier three iteration of it. But once you're at that tier three iteration, like you're going to see, I mean. So, okay. Let me explain how it works first, I guess. You already know that it works off healing. Why does it work so well with Chiron then? Because Chiron's... It, first off, it has to be abilities. It doesn't work on lifesteal. So, that's one thing. Um, And it has to be on a physical god because it has 40 power. Now, it, it's not too great on Hercules, even though his 3 does heal twice. Yeah, I, I, There's no way to get maximum stacked on him. Um, it's mainly used for Arachne to get 50% attack speed, 15% power, which is insane. And Chiron, because his passive. Because what you're looking for, realistically, you're dead again, by the way. What you're realistically looking for, for a user of Vital Amplifier, is somebody who has a ticking heal who is a physical god who can use it from an ability. Now, Chiron's passive technically counts as an ability. So because of that, I'm going to go from 134 damage in auto attack. Hold on. Does this make my butt look big? I do have to be missing health for my passive to proc, by the way. I can't actually proc unless I'm missing health. So right now you see my attack speed is a 1.34. That is going to shoot up to a 1.64 in uh, in a second. Right here, actually. Yeah, look at my damage. 242 and a 1.64 attack speed. Look at that power. Look at that. Look at that. And the buff lasts for 6 seconds. So you got time to get your passive back from the buff. And use another ability to keep it up. You just have a permanent 50% attack speed and 15 physical power. I'm hitting towers for 100 damage almost at level 5 with two items. Like, this is ridiculous. I'm hitting it for literally 100. This is ridiculous. And then because my passive just is tick healing, it just keeps resetting my vital amplifier. Now, obviously, your passive can run out or you're not, like, fighting, so it's not technically permanent, but it's permanent in the sense where if you're fighting, you have it, always. He actually almost juked me. That would have been sad. Um, Yeah, it's honestly just absurd. You're taking towers faster. You're doing incredible damage to everything. Just a little bit faster. Just a little bit faster. I'm going to dash. Reset my stacks. Get my healing going. I drop my one on this buff. Reset my stacks. Get my healing going. Like, I have Transcendence and 1.7 attack speed. And I only have two items. <laughs> and 150 power. Like, what? It's just too much. It's just too much. I mean, that. there's no... There's no secret to it. It's just too much. Hello. You're dead. I missed. Meditation? He has a breastplate and I'm still doing 100 damage in auto attack. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know if they just didn't think someone could abuse this, but uh, they can. 
And it's it's better on Chiron than it is Arachne because Arachne can only use it on her one, which means you can get about you can get max stacks of the vital amplifier once every eight to ten seconds. Um I'm just looking if there's anything else I want. I could go healing increased. I could do a healer Chiron or yeah, a healer Chiron build. You just go power and the three healing things. Because this increases your healing by 30%, by the way. The scepter. It's pretty good. And that increases my passive too. Um This is not a lifesteal build, by the way. I have no lifesteal. I just have healing. <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. You ass. Come back here. Look at how much healing I have, dude. My ability goes off and I heal like 250 health. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Look at my healing. I hit the Titan for 200. I would like to point out that I have not used my Claw Shard once this game, except for just now. Oh, hey. You spawned. That was cute. I'm actually a healer. This is pretty nuts. And then another 100 gold and I get this. After healing yourself or an allied god with an ability for the next 6 seconds each time you damage an enemy god, your non-ultimate ability cooldowns are reduced by 0.5. This reduction can only occur once per second. The effect may only occur once every 12 seconds. So basically, after I heal myself, and I do some damage to him. I just start killing. That's what it means. So I heal myself. And now I have all the swirly stuff around me. Now anytime I damage a god, my cooldowns get lowered. And then that, that effect happens once every 12 seconds. Okay. I'm just going to end the game, by the way. Because it's my time to shine. He just can't do anything, man. I don't know. I used my one. I had 1425 health. By the time my pass is over, I have 1540. I literally heal. Because I have three ticks on my passive. I heal 400 health for my passive. That just restacks over and over and over and over. This is just insane honestly just insane hold on i'll be right back Sorry about that. I have a plumber coming and he was supposed to come at eight and it is nine and I gave up hope and started recording. And I was going to say if he showed up immediately, right when I started recording, I was going to lose it. All right. GG though, man. GG. Honestly, the doom, doom orbs a good item too. But yeah, so, um, Vital Amplifier is insane. Healer Chiron is in the game, and he is something you need to be scared of. Uh, it's, it's honestly just... It's annoying. He's just too good. He's just too good. And if you guys want, in the comments down below, uh, tell me if you want to see this Vital Amplifier on Arachne, because what I can do is I can go Hastened Katana, 
and Vital Amplifier and just like stick onto him with like Golden Blade, Hasting Katana and Vital Amplifier, maybe a Blood Forge as well because that gives you, you some movement speed and just stay on him and be like an actual spooter. I don't know though. Uh, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and until next time y'all, peace.